the US Supreme Court intends to repeal Roe v. Wade, a bill that gives women autonomy over their own bodies and lives. But what exactly is Roe v. Wade? Roe is short for Jane Roe, which is a pseudonym for a woman named Norma McCorvey. McCorvey became pregnant with her third child in 1969, but lived in Texas where abortion was only permitted if the mother's life was threatened. Her attorneys filed a lawsuit on her behalf against local district attorney Henry Wade, alleging that Texas's abortion laws were unconstitutional. The US District Court of the Northern District of Texas heard the case and ruled it in McCorvey's favor. Texas then appealed directly to the Supreme Court, who issued a 7-2 decision that ruled that the US Constitution protects a pregnant woman's liberty to choose to have an abortion without excessive government restriction. In the present, a leaked draft opinion suggests the US Supreme Court is poised to overturn Roe v. Wade. In the draft written by Justice Samuel Alito, he wrote, the right to abortion is not deeply rooted in the nation's history and traditions. If the draft opinion holds, all of Roe v. Wade will go, which means there will be no federal constitutional right for a woman to choose to have an abortion. The end of Roe v. Wade will impact reproductive rights in the US, but the consequences may have global significance. Roe v. Wade is a law that's been in place for 50 years, but could unravel in a matter of months. It's a stark and important reminder of how quickly rights can be taken away.